clicking on this video, you are the best. So today I wanted to get into 10 ways you guys can slim your waist and achieve the abs you want. So the first thing is going to be drinking lots of water. Your body is made up of 72% water, so you have to be consuming at least 8 cups of glasses. 8 cups of gl glasses, yeah. You're totally going to drink just glasses. Bruh. But glasses of water um, a day. 2.2 liters for men and then 3.2 liters for Oh, actually vice versa 3.2 liters for men and 2.2 liters for women um, If you want to be exact, but um, usually like even if you can shoot for a gallon a day, that'd be amazing I don't think anyone I don't even drink that much water, but if I did I would be like drinking lots of water yeah, 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 sweet sweatband and you use that while you work out put the coconut oil on your waist and you work out intensely for 30 to an hour um, you will see results and this is this is actually has helped me a lot and um, it doesn't it doesn't cinch my organs and I think a lot of people are fearful that it's, it's gonna hurt their organs but I don't think and then um, the third thing I wanted to share with you guys is drinking and eating your veggies. So number four would be your nutrition. Your nutrition is the most important part of anything to transform your body to the way you want it to be. So eating lots of fats, lots of carbs, I mean not, not lots of fats, don't eat lots of fats and carbs, like that, that would just probably be bad, but it's part of a balanced diet. So having some healthy fats, some carbohydrates, some protein, and of course you're getting your vegetables and fruits in the mix. So having a really clean diet, not eating over processed foods, lots of sugars, things that your body has to work in over time to break down the food and digest. Basically eating processed foods is making your body work harder to get rid and digest the food properly. So by eating healthy, we're providing our body leeway to manage our food in a more peaceful and harmonic way where we don't have to work in overtime and basically um, tell our body, okay, you gotta work in overtime to digest this red meat or you gotta digest this donut I just ate, you know. So it really just comes in all into play. So having a clean diet is really important to getting a toned look and having a more flat stomach. So, so number five would be on my list would be, I can't even think of it well. I'm like, uh. Okay, so number five. Um, number five. I recommend um, getting spirulina. I don't know if any of you have heard of it, but it's a chlorophyll. It's a chlorophyll powder that is really good for brain, eye health, um, and really cleansing out toxins in your body. And it provides you with most of um, vitamins like barocarotene, vitamin A, which is barocarotene, B12. Um, it has some iron. It's a vegan multivitamin. If you guys are plant-based or vegan, this is definitely recommended for you. I would definitely try this out. Um, but yeah, spirulina is what really helped me too. And then the sixth thing, the sixth, number six is going to be green tea. Um, drinking tea two to times, two times a day. Drinking one in the morning, drinking one in the afternoon. If you guys drink tea, you guys will see a difference in your health, your energy levels. It keeps your metabolism going. It burns it burns fat, so it's actually really great for working out, doing cardio. You come home, have some green tea, you know, um, get your pre uh, post protein shake in, and then a cup of green tea or whatever you want to have. It is really good for you guys to drink that. I think fully recommend doing that. Um, so number seven would be fruits. So if you guys are have access to fruits, you guys should definitely take advantage of that. Um, lots of fruits in the morning on an empty stomach, that's really good for you too. Berries, strawberries, um, pineapple, that's really good tummy blaster. That's like a really good tummy, like nice and, nice and flat. I'm sorry, I'm bloated right now. But anyway, so basically fruits. And then, um, Number eight would be working out. Duh! Okay, yeah. Exercising. So if you guys get in 30 minutes of exercises in the day, exercising. Oh. 
Oh yeah. Okay, anyway. So, um, number 10 would be a probiotic. I think gut health is so important and vital to um, just having a better um, gut. And I think gut health has a lot to do with a lot of problems t in today's society with a lot of diseases and um, diabetes. Oh, I don't think it has anything to do with diabetes. Uh, okay, anyway, don't quote me on that. But, um, so gut health is so important and that's my 10th thing that I would recommend. So a probiotic kombucha, anything that um, Greek yogurt um, is really good. It has some probiotics in there and it's really good for providing you with the probiotics. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah, so probiotics. So if you guys like this video, even though I kind of messed up a lot, but if you guys like this video, can you go ahead and give it a like and a thumbs up and subscribe for more information. I am going to be giving you more valuable content that you guys can use in your daily life and nutrition tips coming at you live. So now that you guys have sat through my introduction. I am going to be giving you all my tips on, I'm just joking, I'm not that cheesy. Anyway, so if I was like a cheesy YouTuber, you guys would not respond, but you guys are here and I'm excited. I'm excited to tell you what I know. Yeah. So here are 10 ways to slim your waist. Let's get started.